Hello, I'm Chris, this is Gross Models, and a very warm welcome back to Back to the Future DeLorean. Uh, this has been on hold for a while, it has been saved by a fan home who are kindly sending me this kit to build, and uh, I'm picking up where I left off. This is issue 55. Uh, let's have a flick through the magazine, and then we'll get to the building. Now, this is in a different order to the other ones. Uh, the building parts are first, but we'll flick through those first. Uh, then we can have a look at the production diary and the time traveler's guide. So in this issue, uh, we are building the bulkhead uh, and putting in the fake speakers uh, and some switches and things behind the seats. So uh, yeah, that's nice and easy to build. Nice, quick, getting us back in quite easily construction. Uh, not dealing with the wheels or anything. We're just dealing with the interior, getting that going. So I shall do that momentarily. Uh, and let's have a look. We cut into the chase, uh, the production diary, uh, filming of the hoverboard chase. There's more of, I don't remember that. It's been a year since I did one of these videos. If you're watching this in the playlist and, have, you know, just caught up, then Eagle Moss folded. Uh, they disappeared and all of the builds that they had going on stopped, basically. Uh, so this is why there's been a while. If you don't know anything about that, then don't worry about it. It's going to continue on as it did before but just from a different supplier. This is now from Fan Home. Uh, so yes, we've got uh, the hoverboards that don't work on water, apparently. Futuristic cars from, you know, several years ago. It didn't happen. The future. They predicted a future that didn't happen. Who could have thought? Uh, Jason Scott Lee, uh, part of Griff's hoverboard gang. And then he became Bruce Lee in Dragon. I didn't know that. I wouldn't have recognised him from that anyway. So that's that. Uh, next time... We have the circuit board. We're going to tidy up some of the loose ends of the wires that we've got, again, on the part that we're dealing with now. Uh, that's that. So, and that's the parts that we've got today in the nice grayscale. I remember them doing that. It looks quite cool. Right, let me clear this out of the way. I'll show you the parts that we've got in this, this uh, issue, and we'll get them assembled. Yes, so here we have the parts in this issue. We've got one of the gray... Uh, bulkhead parts, uh, some screws, a sticker, uh, some little switches, and two fake speakers. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is install one of these fake speakers uh, onto here. Uh, that's going on there. We've got a screw hole and a peg, so just make sure they line up the correct way round. That goes on there like so, uh, and while I'm doing that, I'm going to put the switches in place as well. They hold in exactly the same way in the other hole, like so. Uh, and we're using AP screws to hold those in place. So let's get two of those out. As ever, they supply more than you need. So we'll keep the spare one of those in the packet, or if they're needed down the line. And these two screws are gonna go through these two holes. And hold that in place. Holds the speaker in place, and this one will hold that screw in place. There. Just like that. Here we have that. Uh, so we've got three BP screws, and one AP. I think I'm going to be using the other AP screw, actually. There may not be a spare there, uh, because we're going to be attaching this to this the interior that we've been doing for many, many months, many months ago. Uh, it still looks lovely. It might be a little bit dusty, but it's okay. Uh, so yes, this is what we have so far. Uh, I vaguely remember doing bits of it, but not much. So yeah, there we have it. Uh, this is the hole that we're going to be fitting this into. Uh, and that goes in there, that way around. Just like that, basically. So you can sort of see it down the back there a little bit where these wires come out as well. Uh, and that is being held in place with the two BP screws. One on either side. Nice and easy. One screw ready to go. We'll tip that back up in place. Like so. It located where it should be there you go and then these we'll just hold it in place get those in a bit I shall 
make sure I get them all lined up properly and tightened down fully in a moment. Uh, but next up, we're doing a thing. Uh, we've got to fit the other one. Uh, let's just check that screw. Yeah, that is the other AP screw we are going to use. Because we need to put the other speaker in place behind the other seat. Um, so we slide that seat forward, get that out of the way. That will just pop in there. Again, if you get it the right way round, then we can put a screw in the back there, just like we did on the plate, except not on the plate. I'm assuming that these speakers are a, a factory fitted uh, item. They've not been added by Doc. Uh, not sure about the switches, maybe. I don't really know. But uh, that's that. Uh, and the only other thing to do is to pick the sticker. This is in preparation for next time. Um, where we've got a circuit board being fitted. And it's being fitted on those four screws there. So we need to cover over screws just to make sure there's no shorting going on, I think. You're not going to be able to see this behind the circuit board there anyway. So that will just cover over those and make sure the screws are not going to short out against the circuit board. So that is that. It feels good to get back in the saddle, back in the seat, in the driver's seat of the DeLorean. So uh, that is that. So far, so good. I shall get these screws tightened up before I come back next time to do the second part. Now, this delivery, because it's getting started, is only two issues. So I've got these two, but the next one is even on its way to me, even as we speak already. So very soon, we will continue with more of this and continue on with the build going forward. So thank you very much for joining me. Thank you very much for Pan Home for getting this set up and starting off again. And I shall see you very shortly for the next one. So thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye bye for now.